Sa'ad says, uh, what's your ruling on following one of the imams of the four schools of thought or the Prophet ﷺ? This is hypothetical. They're all following the Prophet ﷺ. But to come and say, I will ignore all four schools of thought and I will only follow the Quran and Sunnah, you have to be in their level. Yes, if you're a student of knowledge and you know fluent Arabic and you have the necessary tools to look into their schools of thought and filter it and reach what, you, what, what is most likely to be authentic according to the Quran and Sunnah with the understanding of the Salaf, then go ahead. Other than that, no, it is uh, 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 preposterous to just ignore all the Salaf and all the schools of thought and just depend on your own intellect thinking that you know. And finally, who should we follow? There are so many sects and cults around us. You, achi, this is a 100 uh, a million dollar question that requires a thorough answer and which we don't have time for but look for a scholar who you trust his iman his knowledge his moral conduct uh, his righteousness and you trust him in whatever he says and follow him and he inshallah will guide you to jannah and allah knows best